Hey everybody, I'm Pritam Bhadra. I'm a motivational speaker and corporate trainer. I help professionals and entrepreneurs excel at their communication skills, develop leadership capabilities and master their digital presence. And you are here in the series where you can take yourself from being challenges to opportunities. So today we are discussing about the third strategy that is to fail and fail better. See, when you are at a problematic situation, when you are facing challenges and you're taking those challenges, there are chances that you will fail. And guess what? You need to fail and you need to fail, fail quickly and fail better. The reason why I'm saying this is because most of the people don't like failing. They have this fear of failure and that's the reason why they are always scared and also have this feeling of trauma. Every single time they want to go out of the comfort zone and take the opportunity. Because sometimes for some people, even opportunity is like a risk. So every single time you get these opportunities, make sure that you grab them, these challenges, grab them. And then if you have to fail, then fail and fail quickly because the sooner, the faster you fail, the more you will learn and then you'll get back up in order to do better challenges and then you'll fail better. And one day all these things are going to help you, all these things, all these challenges, problems, opportunities and learnings are going to synchronize and then you will find success. That's what happens. That's how we master every single skills, isn't it? Whether it's how I speak of public speaking, confidence, camera presence, or it's of art, it's of dance, any kind of anything, any skill that you see is being mastered by these process. So make sure that when you get a challenge, you accept it and then work on it. See, most people will say you in order to save themselves and save yourself that don't go out and take the opportunities. Don't go out and take the you know challenges because it's hard, it's difficult, and you don't know what's going to be the future. You don't know whether it's going to be certain for you or not because most of the time it's uncertain and that's what gives you an expression that there's something that is going to be on that difficult side and I might not be able to do it. Why to take the risk? You take the risk because you want to learn. Even, see, today you don't take the risk. Maybe 10 years down the line, you'll feel like doing it because you'll have the feeling of regret that you didn't take the decision one, 10 years ago. That's the reason why you feel like doing it now. And at that point of time, you eventually have to take it and the world would have transformed. If you and me, if we don't transform, the world will. And that point of time is going to be even more difficult to you. Then why not take the challenge now? Why not fail now, fail better, so that you and I can gear up for the future to come. And guess what? We're going to make the world a better place. This is what I'm trying to do with my videos. I hope that these kind of videos are full of energy, motivation, and inspiration. Something helping you in order to boost yourself up from the screen in whichever way I can, I'm doing it. Right? I'm committed to, to de deliver all these videos to you so that these videos will be creating an impact. Thank you so much for watching my videos and make sure that you subscribe and follow me in order to have all the updates of my coming videos because I'm going to share a lot of inspiration and amazing videos to help you transform yourself both in personal 